Hi, I'm Dean. And I'm Ann. We are A&D Adventures on Timber Mountain. Please like, share, and subscribe to our channel. We'd greatly appreciate it. The new uh, dado blade that we bought for uh, grooving the panels are working out very well. Here you see us uh, dadoing the oak boards to fit them together to make one large panel. It's about 54 inches wide by 54 inches long. So what we did originally on uh, the other episode is we did glue two of the panels together and now we're making sure that the the two panels that we did glue together are now six glued together. Correct. To make 54 inches. Here you see us sanding um, to level the boards and to make it smooth before we stain. The uh, process of sanding is important because it helps the stain to penetrate. Since we're using oak, it's important, and the sanding will help the uh, oil or the uh, stain penetrate. As you can see, we put some uh, colors on a board to see which one we wanted, and we decided to go with the cherry. Which is a nice, rich color. Um, as you can see, we're doing one side of the board, but we actually had to do both sides, and we had to wait uh, a good... Uh, 24 hours before doing the opposite side as well but there was four the four sides to do so we did two in one day and now two, two in the, in the next, next day, day. Yeah, correct just doing a, a few final touches it looks good and now we're starting the uh, pine frame uh, again using the dado blade to uh, take out our uh, grooves and to uh, make sure that uh, the tongue and groove matched up for our boards. So you'll see Dean measuring it every so often to make sure that we have the right size and depth. depth. Correct. So that here we are assembling the uh, pine uh, frame to We're, make sure that it is square. Correct. We're doing a pre... Uh, pre-fit just to make sure the panels we just did the glue up on will fit inside so you have to put everything together dry fit they call it and uh, the panel indeed our measurements were correct and we were able to fit the panel which are already stained so again we have to go through the process of sanding uh, all the sides of the board because we have to stain every side of the board which is a long process again because we have to do one side and then the other side um, as you can see we're flipping it here and here again we are staining the pine and we hope you enjoyed thank you for watching thank you